a so I'm here in Space Engine. Um, I've been playing with that for quite a while now in the beta, and I finally got it in uh, Steam. That's out there. We can actually pay money for it now. Definitely worth it if you like space stuff. It's like, as far as I can tell, the best easy uh, universe simulator there is out there. Well, so here's one of the interesting things that I actually first discovered in Space Simulator, but a long time ago, but you can still see it. And that's stars aren't round necessarily. Like some of them are roundish, but um, or I should say spherical, right? They're still round, but they're not like you know, like you can see this one right here, right? It's squished. It's like a like I don't know, egg shape. Well, not really egg shape. More like a hamburger type of shape. Is a good, better word. You know, like, if I go top, it looks round, but if I'm looking at it from the side, you can tell it's actually bulged in the middle. And this is apparently actually pretty common. And that's just not something I really thought about. You always think of our star, which is round, like spherical. Well, it's also vaguely squished, but very little. Same with the Earth. The Earth is squished at the poles just a little bit. But in some of these stars, you can get some massive squishing going on. Like, this is probably, like, this is a reasonable estimate for the specific star that I'm looking at, which I read a lot about for various reasons. Um, actually, I should, actually, I should talk about that, yeah. So, this star is HIP28041, or HD39816. Um, but it also has an older name of Gors Nova, or it's also U Orionis. It's got a couple of names. Um, that's why I'm interested in it. It's the original name, Gors Nova. So there's a guy, John Ellard Gore, pretty vaguely, well, I don't know if famous astronomer, but like he was a he was a guy. Uh, he did he was doing astronomy as a hobby in the late 1800s, and um, He's a relative of mine, so and my last name's also Gore. So I happened to I've looked at several of his stars, and just because of that. And this one happens to be Gore's Nova. And at the time they thought it was might be a Nova. It's not. It's just a red dwarf. But yeah, so HD three nine eight one six HIP two eight zero four one. It's in. Space Engine. It's also in Elite Dangerous, and I actually managed to scan the planets. I was the first person to scan the planets on that, which is fun. Uh, although somebody had beat me to the star itself, which kind of sucks. But whatever. Um, yeah, but the interesting thing is the star is squished. There's, and there's lots of other good examples of this. Uh, the planets here are not real, but it is generally thought of as possibly having at least one companion and that might be why it's actually bulging so much like if you had a massive companion like say this was a giant something that could be why it's appearing so so bulged to us so yeah so yeah stars aren't flat 